Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. We just got done putting on our TerraFlex tire carrier to replace this Mopar plastic crap. Anyway, we were always afraid with a 100 pound wheel and tire combo that that was gonna let go off road or even worse, let go going down the interstate and the tire end up in somebody's windshield. So we got on uh, got online and checked some stuff out. I couldn't find a bumper with a tire carrier that I liked, so we decided to go this route. I already had it installed a uh, reinforcement plate. I believe this one was from Red Rock, if I'm not mistaken. It allowed me to continue to use that. Uh, this thing's highly adjustable. It can, uh, you know, vertically and horizontal. It let me tuck my tire closer, and I was able to shed some weight because I had to, uh, with my 35 on the factory bumper, I had already had to put a relocation plate, and that was kind of a heavy piece of metal. So we was able to get rid of that. So we saved on some weight, and... It also allows us to move the third brake line to here so it's not covered up by the tire anymore. And so far we're pretty happy with it. It seems to be extremely stout. When I had the, the factory one on there, I could grab the tire and, and wiggle it. It had some give, you know, kind of spongy, just didn't have a warm fuzzy feeling about it. So installation was pretty easy. We didn't do an installation video for it. Uh, it just uses your OEM bolts to attach to the tailgate has two bolts on either side of the carrier for uh, in and out adjustment. And then it has a main lock here. Getting the camera out of the factory housing was really easy. It's just three screws, pop it out the back, put it in here. And then it's got a little adapter plate that goes over basically for cosmetic reasons to cover it up. And two OEM screws used to attach this to the TerraFlex third light brake carrier. So there's really not much to it. It only took about an hour, hour and 15 minutes. And we were going slow because we took all the reinforcement plates out and cleaned all the dirt and dust that was stuck behind there out too. So if you're looking for a good tire carrier, I would definitely give this one a, uh, a thumbs up. Thanks for watching. See you next time.